Hey guys, so I am still alive. Um, I haven't died in some freak accident or uh, I'm in any kind of K-pop coma. Um, it's been about 10 days since my last video, so I do apologise. Um, I really wish I could give you some kind of good excuse for why, why I haven't uploaded a video for a while, but I generally have been really, really busy and it just, my life just seems to be out of my hands at the moment. I just, everyone around me seems to want me, which is really unusual. <laughs> um, so yeah, I've not been able to really like film videos, plus I've not really gotten an awful lot of stuff. Um, so I figured that I would kind of just do a quick video just to say that I'm still alive. Um, I'm really sorry that I haven't really uploaded anything for a while. Um, I have had a few things in the post. The most important thing is this. Um, I did actually film um, an unboxing for this. I've had this for over a week now, probably like 10 days. I probably I probably got it a couple of days after I uploaded the Yixing haul video that's on my channel. Um, and so, yeah, I'm really sorry about the glare. Um, I'm going to just leave it there. So it is uh, Big Bang's made movie program book thing so I will upload that one after this one because I have had it filmed I just every time I've gone to like go to my laptop to upload and stuff I've just like not felt like doing it I don't know whether that's just like laziness probably is laziness I'm just like oh god the laptop's so far away it's so much effort it's on the sofa that I'm you know I'm sat next to it but whatever so uh, <laughs> maybe it's my age um but yeah so i will i will be unboxing this one um soon i promise so i have had that one and um i've also had this one which is also very glary um it's tv excuse humanoids and this actually completes my korean collection i mean it doesn't complete complete it if i was a collector i would like not be complete but i am complete in the sense that i have all of their Korean albums, a version of all of their Korean albums. So this was the only one I was missing. So this is the sixth album repackaged. So I was missing the sixth album. I've got a copy of all of their other Korean albums. This was the last one I was missing. So so I'm happy with that. Um, I'm not going to do an unboxing for this one because there's like a gazillion of them on there. So, but I'm really happy that I have it. Yay. Um, and like literally this is the only thing that has arrived in the last um, like 10 days <laughs> so I did get paid um, a couple of weeks ago now I'm already broke um, I have got some stuff none of that has arrived but today I did get a package and it was um, something that I ordered um, a while ago um, and that only arrived today so I figured I would do um, yeah this kind of small little whole thing. So um, I have got Kayanenka part two. Um, I'm not going to um, do an unboxing for that one either because there's no bloody point. This is the only picture on the CD. Like it's a CD and DVD. There's a gazillion unboxings. I'm not going to do it. I've just, I've got it for collector's purposes, but I'm really disappointed with Big Hit because there's not a single photo on there at all. So that's it's really pissed me off. I'm so I don't really want to talk about it. Um, yeah. <laughs> and then the last thing is I'm catching up with my A Pink stuff. So I have brand new days. And um, I will open this one actually just to show you because I'm not going to do an unboxing. Um, but I got Hyung's CD plate. So if anyone wants to trade Hyung for Bommy, by all means we can do so. Um, however, with the card, I got Namju. So I'm actually really happy with my card. Um, it's just the plate I would probably trade mostly just for me to be honest with you but yeah I'm gonna put that there because it takes so long um so <laughs> I really apologize I also um I'm gonna have some other stuff but not like an awful lot I think I've only got like two packages on their way but it's quite expensive so um the only thing I will mention is probably something that maybe some of you would want me to talk about and that is black pink playing in the background um Boombaya and Whistle being their first two Daily songs. Um, I know there's a lot of mixed reactions to them, and 
I'm fairly certain I knew that I was going to like that pink because I am a YG stan. Well, I've always been a YG stan, being a VIP. Um, as I say, I'm not a stan of YG himself, or the company, but of the actual artists. I always love the music that they do. And I really, really liked it. Um, it does have a 21 feel, clearly. But I think that um, it's still a really good vibe. Rather than being negative about that, I'm going to be positive. There's not a lot of um, female K-pop idols that have this kind of style. So the ones that do, I kind of want to cherish <laughs> and support. A lot of them are very cutesy, who I love, or very sexy. And I really liked Bumbaya, it was probably my favourite. So I definitely liked that song. Whistle was really good as well, but I don't listen to it like I listen to Bumbaya. Bumbaya seems to be on my um, in my head quite often. <laughs> so um, yeah, it's it's going to be an interesting. I'm going to compare them not to Twenty One. I'm actually going to compare them to Icon, in the sense of the hype surrounding their debut. There was a big hype around Icon's debut because obviously the the delay. I mean, we, we waited like two years, three years for Icon. I've lost track of how many years actually. No, it's two years, isn't it? Um, oh. But uh, there was so much hype for Icon, and I'm a big fan of Icon, as you guys know. But I still feel like they didn't live up to the hype. Um, I feel like they can grow. I mean, when, uh, when they came out with their first album, I didn't like it at all. I thought it sucked, to be honest with you. But their new one, oh, I love it. Baby Baby uh, is just like the, one of the best songs of the year. And I really love how much they've grown. And I'm hoping that Icon will do that. So I want to kind of compare Blackpink to them in the sense that all the hype being YG's new girl group. Um, do I feel like they're living up to their expectation? I feel a little bit, yes. I feel more positive about them, their music than I do for Icon. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm going to say watch the space. They've got, I think, six more tracks they're going to be promoting. <laughs> um, so, which is great. I'm glad that, you know, YG is focusing on on Blackpink and not, you know, on any other one, anyone else. <laughs> Though I don't actually know what's happened with Winner. It could be nice for him to actually focus some on Winner because I thought that's what he was going to be doing. Um, but yeah, there we go. Um, it's about to be Big Bang's 10th anniversary so i'm very much looking forward to something dropping fingers crossed um and yeah this is kind of my video i'm going to stop talking now please feel free to leave a comment and shout at me for having been 10 days since my last one uh, i promise it won't be 10 days to my next one so <laughs> see you in 10 days now i promise it won't be um until next time guys ciao